So the, um, the five-time NCLEX failure story. Um, there was a student. Now, we, we help, obviously, I help people pass their NCLEX all the time. And if you don't know, the NCLEX is the board you have to take to actually become an RN, a registered nurse, uh, or an LVN, or an LPN. Same thing as a lower nurse. But this lady failed the NCLEX five times. Do you know how much it costs to, uh, you know, every time you take it? It's $200. So she ended up spending about $1,000 on failed attempts. Imagine being like, you know, her in her shoes. Two years she spent in nursing school. Sacrificed. Been with her brothers and sisters, right, in nursing school. She didn't fail. She got good grades. She dedicated her life. Her husband worked another job for her. She <laughs> sacrificed with her kids. And now her family's looking at her and saying, we did all this for you. And you failed? You failed us. You're a failure. Not only are you getting pressure from your, everyone in your family, you just wasted how many? Imagine, okay, so let's just say you want to be an actor and you were this close to getting the, the interview or whatever. You went to acting school, everything, but you're failing every single time. It's only one test. The NCLEX is only one test. If you fail it once, sure, it sucks, it hurts. But failing it five times? Imagine her going in on her sixth time. I give her even credit for trying. That's insane. So by the time she came to me, she's like, Mike, I failed the NCLEX five times. And in my mind, I'm thinking, I'm usually very, you know, motivation. And very like, uh, I'm thinking like, oh my gosh. <laughs> I've helped people who failed three times. The statistically speaking, after your third time passing, you only have a 9% chance at ever passing. And then it goes down every other time that you fail. So technically she had like a 7% chance of passing. And I'm thinking about that, thinking, can we even help this student? But I'm like, okay, well, I'm going to do the best I can. That's all I can do. I can't predict the results. I can predict how we prepare for the results. So I put her through a pharmacology boot camp, um, my 92 videos on pharmacology. She was struggling with pharm. Put her through the entire med surge course, horrible med surge, and put her through uh, the psychiatric videos. And then I taught her how to study with our videos, put her through our, basically our system. And she's like, Mike, I feel prepared. I feel like I'm getting a lot of the information um, on Facebook. And I'm like, okay, well, you know, keep on going. Uh, we'll see you and, you know, do good on your test. And I'm thinking, you know, good luck. And she comes back to me in two weeks. And I'm expecting like, okay, you're probably going to tell me some bad news. She's like, oh my gosh, Mike, I actually passed I am an RN. My whole family is rejoicing you now because you took from depression and debt now to the career of her dreams. She's pretty much the idol of her family now. Her kids love her. Her husband is so proud of her. And now she has a career she can call her own and have her dreams fulfilled. So we really are changing the future of nursing studies worldwide.